girls welcome to my channel it's your girl zakimilda i'm a makeup artist and a content creator this is actually my first youtube video and i'm super duper excited about it because i am so passionate about beauty makeup lifestyle and fashion so please so show me some love subscribe button and let's have a look together have you been wondering the kind of simple makeup you can wear to class you can wear to lecture you can wear to work you can wear to booze house you definitely need to keep on watching We're starting with a baby wipes to clean our face or oh, rather my face uh, I'm cleaning it to remove every single bit on my face so um I'm going to be using this brush to brush up my hair and I'm going to be using Davis eye pencil color 18 to draw my brows so first and foremost I'm gonna brush up my hair then I'm going to apply a primer so guys I'm using this pond I'm using pond as a primer to prime my brows that way it can last longer my eye pencil can last longer Then I'm using my brush to brush the hair up. Now I'm going in with my eye pencil. So I'm gently filling it in. So getting to this point, I'm using a lighter stroke, okay? So, next up, I'm brushing everything up, okay, using my brush. So, guys, to conceal, I'm using Dema Essential Oil Control Concealer and LA Girl Pro Concealer. This LA Girl Pro Concealer is in the shade um, Dark Cocoa and then this um, Demi Essential um, Concealer is in the shade Fawn. So now, to conceal, you have to use two shades lighter than your skin tone under your eyebrow. Then for the upper part, you're using this, the, the concealer that has the same shade with your skin tone. Okay, so for this down part, I'm using Fawn. It has it actually has two shades lighter than my skin tone. So I'm just basically gonna put it at the back of my palm. Get on that one put it at the back of my palm. Then I'm getting this pro concealer in the shade dark cocoa. Um, I'll put it at the back of my palm 
okay using um angle brush from bobby brown to conceal so i'm basically gonna guys this So to conceal this cloth, this outer part, I'm going to be mixing. I'm going to be mixing the Elegio Point Concealer and the Dama Essential together to get my the shade of my skin color. That is, I'm going to be mixing these two together. So, to clean up the Essex concealer, I'm gonna be cleaning the one hair on this brush first of all. Now, watch how I do it. This is, I'm cleaning it off. Now, it's clean. So, I'm basically using it to clean the excess. I'm using this brush to drag the excess concealer down. Now, while doing this, you have to be very careful not to use the brush to enter into the main eyebrow that you've already drawn. So I'm gently dragging it, gently dragging it down, dragging it down. I'm using this brush, it's still from Bobby Brown. <laughs> so I guess I'm a big fan of Bobby Brown. So I'm using this brush to, to press in the concealer. Now again, I'm gonna conceal this other part, this other side. So getting to this closer part, this outer part, I'm still gonna mix again. See, mixing the old one. Sorry, what I did. Now, again, I'm gonna clean the excess of the brush and I'm gonna be dragging it down. Again, I'm cleaning it off with this Bobby Brown brush. Now, for the upper part of my brows, like I said, I'll be mixing this Dema Essential in the shade form and I'll be mixing it with Elegant Prom Concealer in the shade dark cocoa to get this, the, the, the shade of my skin tone yeah so that is basically what I'm doing right now and I'm gently doing that Is it hazy? Say, guys, it's so very simple. 
I have to practice, practice, practice. Then I'm still gonna use my brush again. <laughs> So I'm still gonna do the exact thing here. That's that for the eyebrow. So um, I'm gonna be using this eyebrow wax from Say the Beauty Model. Okay. I'm using it to brush up. So guys, I hope you love the eyebrow hairs. It's looking nice to me. So next up, we are moving over to the eyeshadow pan. So, um, I'm using this eyeshadow primer. Eyeshadow primer from what is the company? Berlin. Yeah, Berlin eyeshadow primer. I've been using it for quite a while now, and I really like it. I I like it. I just love it. So since it's my face, I'm using my hand to. So since it's actually a simple look that you can wear to work, you can wear to the ones I mentioned about, the eyeshadow is still gonna look so simple and natural. Up next is our eyeshadow and guess the palette I'm using, I'm using LV Beauty Palette, yeah, using this eyeshadow palette, I've used it for a while too, um, it's, it's nice. So I'm using this shade, okay. Sorry, I did not tell you guys. I'm using this shade as my base, my transition color, rather. So, next. I'm using, I'm going in with this other color. It's kind of, let's see, baby pink. Kind of. Uh, I'm going to focus it. So, to blend everything together, I'm still using this transition brush and I'm getting my the color I used for my transition. Um, I'm using it to blend everything. So, up next, I'm using my Huda Beauty Eyeliner Gel. My Huda Beauty Eyeliner Gel. It came with a brush though. So I'm using it. So because it's a simple look, I'm not going to make my eyeliner to be way dramatic. So I'm just applying a very simple Eyeliner Joe. I'm 
I'm still going to use that hair. No, gently draw the nails. So up next, I'm cleaning everything off again with my baby wipes. So I'm going with my face primer bonds again. So I'm using it to. So up next, I'm using Zikel foundation. I'm going in with this. I'm using this board, yeah, colic board, and I'm gonna be pouring my foundation. I'm going in with my beauty blender. yeah if i forget your beauty blender has to be wet it has to be wet before you use it so sorry i had to wet my own behind the camera So guys, so up next, I am using my Derma Essential Concealer in the shade Thorn. That same concealer I used to, to conceal the down part of my brows. That is two shades lighter than your skin tone. So I'm going to be using it to highlight. Gently pressing everything in. See, I'm not scrubbing it. I'm not scrubbing it. Like, I'm not scrubbing it. I am pressing it in gently. That way, it it fits into your skin. To be so, it fits in. Into. So that is that for the highlighting. Now to contour, I'm using a dark shade. Now if you want to contour, you have to use a shade that is dark, not light, dark, not too dark, but a little bit darker than your skin shade. Yeah, I'm actually using my powder to contour. So I'm using this shade to contour. So guys, that is it for the contour. So up next, I'm setting the whole thing. So guys, for the setting powder, I am using Ben. 
setting using the nag setting powder so i'm using this foam to get my setting powder and apply at that same place where i highlight So we are going to allow it for some minutes so it can set. Meanwhile, since it's a simple look, you can choose to apply your lashes or not to apply. But for this look, I'm going to go in with a very tiny lashes. Yeah, very small and tiny. You wouldn't even know that I fixed lashes. That is how tiny it is. Guys, for the lashes, I'm going in with this. I've actually used it before. It's red cherry number one to four. It's very very tiny. It's, it's not really that obvious, so that's why I like it. And since I'm doing a simple brown, it will really go well with it. So for the glues, I'm using this Lanel hair bonding glue. Yeah. So. I'm basically using the back of this lashes, the cover rather, to press in just small. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Because I wouldn't want it to last, I'll just use the back of my tweezer. Uh, and get it so you guys can see what I'm doing. I'm just applying small. Okay, guys. Now I'm going in with the first one. Getting in my tweezer. So I'm getting the second one. So I'm going to use water to press it down guys I'm using water to press it down next I'm using my mascara okay I'm naked yeah So guys, next I'm gonna be using my LA Girl Pro, um, my LA Girl powder palette to dust off the excess setting powder again with my powder brush from Bobbi Brown. okay so for the lips I'll be lining my lips with my dips with Davis eye pencil again next I'm going in with my Huda Beauty Nude Pencil Liner
so guys in order to remove those sharp lines I'm using a brush from Bobby Brown in here to blend everything together I go in with my bronzer I have to wet my brush with um, a certain spray so wet my brush this way and then um, smile now remember since it's a very simple look I'm not supposed to put on a heavy bronzer so I'm just gonna apply it gently and so I'm gonna blend it in with my powder brush so it does not get really shiny Again, I'm going. I'm gonna use my Bobbi Brown brush again, guys. Um, for the blush, I'm getting the blush from the same eyeshadow that I used, the eyeshadow palette. But I'm going in with this color, this one right here. So I'm getting it. I'm applying. Again, the blush should not be too heavy. Okay, so everything will just be partial. In order to make our makeup or uh, rather our uh, eye pop a little bit, I'm going in with this same palette. Yes, but I'm going in with this black under my eye. Guys, up next is my bronzer. I'm using Aurora Glow Kit. Yeah, that's the name of the, the bronzer I'm using. To brighten the eyebrow a little bit, I'm just gonna do this here. To set everything, I'm using Zikel Satin Spray to set everything in. Now this makes it to last. It makes this makes the makeup to last longer. Yeah. So. First off, I'm closing my eyes. Okay, that is that. We are done. I'm just gonna dress my hair. I'm using my gel, my edge contour. <laughs> So guys, this is actually the finished look.
so guys that's the finished look and i hope you love it now this look you can wear it to church you can wear it to class you can wear it to um Google's place so i hope you love the video and if you actually do please give us a thumbs up if you find anything confusing please do not forget to just drop it on the comment section i will make sure i reply to each and every one of them and see you guys in my next video until then stay loved stay blessed stay fabulous i love you guys